I didn't know we were gonna get food <laughs> or drinks. This is pretty cool. Oh, it's gonna be cool. We're Keith and Dev. Our goal is to make the most of each day with adventures big and small. In 2021, we explored Canada from Ontario all the way to Vancouver. And this year, we flew to Europe. Subscribe to follow along. But we're sort of in a rush, as usual. We're leaving our boat to get onto another boat. Today we have quite the adventure plan, right Dev? Yes, I'm very excited. Goodbye, boat. See you, boat. We made it to our bus stop. We dropped off our bags at our hostel we're staying at tonight and instead replaced them with coffees from the same place we went to yesterday. What's called it? Cafe Soldat. So good. And I feel so excited for today because this is something I've wanted to do the whole time we've been on the island and we're doing it on our last day. Today we're going on a catamaran cruise to La Graciosa, which is an island with the best beach around and we haven't gone there yet. It's the island just on the north the top north end of Lanzarote. So we're catching a bus to go to Orzolo, the one place we haven't visited yet, and then we're gonna go on a boat. We made it to Orzola. And we have a bit of time before we catch our catamaran to the island. So ferry. we're taking a ferry to the island and the catamaran on the island. Oh, there we go. <laughs> See, this is why I keep him around. He knows. But I didn't stuff. really pay attention to the timing, so that's why we keep her around. Boarding is at 11:10. So let's explore Orzola. Okay, we had no time to explore the town, but we did get some good drone shots. We're waiting for the ferry now. It's a little wavier than we thought it would be. Holy smokes, we had to move inside. <laughs> it's very wavy out there and this boat is moving a lot. I really like the movement, but we definitely didn't want to get the camera splash. So that's why we had to come in. Oh, it's a lot of fun though. Although I'm a little bit seasick. <laughs> I like it. We made it to our destination. And now we're walking to our boat. Island looks beautiful. You can see the fish, the water is turquoise. This is really cool. It's like going from one paradise to another paradise. That's a melon. They're doing all the languages. I didn't know we were gonna get food <laughs> or drinks. So this is pretty cool. We got more food. Like what? And this time it's a nice baguette with tomato and cheese, all from Lanzarote. And so obviously I'm gonna give the bread to keep, but I'm still gonna eat the tomato and cheese. So, so far we've gotten food, drinks, and the tour guides are hilarious. And incredible they speak every views language. Too. Incredible, incredible views. And we learned about La Graciosa. It's hot. It tarps off. La Graciosa, Spanish for graceful, is a volcanic island in the Canary Islands of Spain, located two kilometers north of Lanzarote across the Strait of El Rio. In 2018, La Graciosa officially became the eighth Canary Island. The island is part of the Chinijo Archipelago and the Chinijo Archipelago Natural Park. The island of La Graciosa is located within the Reserva Marina del Archipelago Chinijo. Its 70,700 hectares make it the largest marine reserve in Europe, and it is an area of outstanding natural beauty. There's the taxi behind us that will take us to the beach on La Graciosa. So we're gonna stay here for a bit, just wait for our turn. Hopefully warm up so we can swim. It's honestly really warm in the sun, but the wind cools it down. Okay, we're gonna take the next taxi. We were just waiting, we thought we'd chill here. But I am so impressed those people are swimming across. It's freezing. I'm gonna try and warm up to go in the water, but I'm very impressed with them. <laughs> you gonna do your countdown when you go in? Your Most one, likely, two, the water yet. is cold one, two, here. Not yet. <laughs> Water's cold here, let's go. 
<laughs> Off we go. Short trip. Oh. We're on the beach. Well, that wasn't very far at all. Oh, is it ever nice here? Warmer over here than on the catamaran. Quite a bit. This sand is nice and toasty. Water down? I feel like I have to because we're here, but I know it's gonna be cold. I think it's 24 degrees, is what he said. So, ah. Celsius. <laughs> and that's not Devon temperature. No, no, it's not. But I need to go in now so that I have time to warm up before we go back to the boat. So that you prove you're not a real wow wow. Because you are a wow wow in our videos. I'm pretty sure. So, Devin wants to delay our dip in the water, obviously, because she's cold. So, we're gonna go kayaking. How's the water, Dev? I'm still avoiding going in it, but I'm gonna do it! Here we are, about to go in, in my new pink bathing suit. Because I lost mine already, within three weeks. That's bad. It is crystal clear water, the water is a good temperature, don't listen to Devin. I'm doing it, I'm going in, because I, I just have to go in every time we go in the water. So beautiful here, it's just so beautiful. This is actually not the bad. Once you're past the wind, the water's actually really beautiful. So I'm gonna go in right now because I bet the water's beautiful. Do it already. Okay, I'm going. Okay. We're back on the boat and it's time for lunch, so we're gonna get in line to get some food. So obviously we got fed tons of food, good fan of tons of food. So over here we have fish and pasta, Devin's got gluten-free food, two salads, beer, banana, like wow, we can't ask for more than that, that's amazing. One other thing I wanted to say while we're eating is I'm just so impressed, everything on here has been reusable. Other than our napkins, which are napkins, everything they they take back, so there's no waste. It's amazing, I love it so much. On the B square, over there, where you see the last ferry, on the B square, if you are on the B square, over there, between 10 past 4 and 25 past 4, this is the boarding time. That was truly incredible. Wow, that was so amazing. There was a dance party we at the We made some end. friends from Paris who told us where to go down the road. Yeah. It was just a vibe. Like, so beautiful, so much sunshine. It was such an incredible experience. And now we have a bit of time to explore the island of La Grosse Yeah, this Only. is the main town of La Grosse. La Graciosa. Sorry, I pronounced it wrong. Only about 20 minutes, but still, we get to now explore the town. Like, I can't, I can't get over this day. It's been beautiful. The water's blowing me away, too. The color of the water is a phenomenal. And it's not as cold as you think it's gonna be. It's only cold when it's windy. It's the only thing that happens in the wintertime. It's windy. Yeah, it's so, amazing. It's been fun. We cannot say enough. Wow, let's okay. go explore. <laughs> We made it to Caleta de Cebo, and we asked our guide who showed us to this church, which is hard to find apparently. And this is the thing to see in this town. And there really are cool. no roads, and it's pretty deserted. This is the only real town on the island, and yeah, there is 
there's no real roads. It's all made of sand. All the houses are actually made on on sand as well. And there's only 500 residents that live here. Oh, so I didn't know that. Cool. Look yeah. at you knowing those facts. Thank you. Impressive. I did know that. It's sort of deserted, but it's kind of pretty. Yeah, it's beautiful. Another place on the island that we haven't seen. Well, because it's a different island. Well, that's so go the old Mrs. Technical. We got to see two islands. <laughs> And just like that, we're back on the ferry. This time we're upstairs in hopes that we won't get wet and we can actually see the views. Wow, first time for everything. That's I think the first we've ever been first. What? Fully eating our banana before we hop on the bus because you know the energy is fading, so the banana brings the energy back up. <laughs> we have to subtitle that. What is it? And we're back where it all started. Wow, what an incredible day and what an incredible way to end our time here we in got Lanzarote. Some good sun in our faces too. Yeah, today was our last day mm -hmm. in Lanzarote. So that was a fantastic way to end it. Yes, if you're on the island, could not recommend a boat tour enough. That was so cool. I'm so happy we did that. Yeah, so incredible. And, and we're, we're, we're tired. But it's the good kind of tired. It's the sunshine, it's the beach, it's just... Yes, like, I can't get over this island. It has been an incredible start to our, our journey, and I'm so happy we got to see so much of this island. So thank you so much to Travel On and... Excursions Landerate for, for making me. today happen. Yes, that because it was incredible. the most amazing way to end <laughs> our time on the island. So tomorrow morning, we're waking up at 4 a.m. to catch a bus to the airport to fly to Madrid. That's right. The next leg of our adventure. But yeah, Recap Lanzarote is a place to visit for sure. So thank you so much for watching. Thanks for watching. See you at 4.30 in the morning. <laughs> oh. Also, yeah, I'm glowing, but that's why I'm in the sun right now. So I don't glow in the future. Okay, I get it. Where did you get that banana? It came with our lunch. Like what? This boat tour is amazing. Banana <laughs> fun.